Above the Arctic Circle, in Lapland, the snow lies thick for three quarters of the year. Okay for warm-blooded mammals, but cold-blooded reptiles? But the versatile viper has even blazed a trail up here, further north than any other snake on the planet. It's the European viper, or adder. There are vipers all over Europe and across Asia. But those that live in the Arctic are a little different. First of all, there's their color. Many Arctic adders are black including the biggest ones and most of the females. Others, like this male, are zigzag. He's spent the last nine months coiled up underground in suspended animation. Thawed out by the first warm spell of summer, he wants to make up for lost time. Finding a mate is his first priority. After all, he gets just three months of parole before the snows return in autumn and he freezes up again. His chosen female is three times his size. Since adders are cold-blooded, black is a good skin color because it absorbs heat faster. So black adders digest food quicker and put on more weight than zigzags. But what this male may lack in size he makes up for in stamina. As soon as the female stops, he begins his seduction, jerking his body and licking her all over. But suddenly, he's not the only suitor on her tail. A large black male has caught her scent. The black male dives straight in, but Zigzag hardly seems to notice him. But soon, this love triangle begins to get out of hand. The female doesn't seem too fussy who she mates with. At the end of the day, whoever gets his tail into position first will win. Three has finally become a crowd. The two males have to thrash it out. But if you can't throw punches or risk damaging your fangs, it can be hard to get a grip on your opponent. The female watches from the sidelines. At this point, size does matter. And it's not in Zigzag's favor. He concedes. 